Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to be showing you guys how the car sounds with the um, the difference in the burbles between soft and medium. Uh, but first, I'm actually going to be going to the gym and then after that we're heading to the BMW dealership. There's a wagon that I saw for sale that I'm trying to get my friend to buy. Uh, and I know he's going to watch this. So hopefully it's not a brand new one because we're not trying to buy a brand new car right now. So, yeah. It's supposed to rain in a couple of days, but we'll go ahead and let you still a quick rent. Baila conmigo, tú no bailas con cualquiera Hagamos en la fiesta en nuestra linda primavera No estamos para podarnos de tanto malos momentos Estamos para disfrutar y vivir una nueva era La más loca, la que más se atreve La envidia de todas las mujeres Está soltera y también como lo mueve Esa cosa sí que tiene poderes Mami, tiene lo que ninguna chica tiene Tanto flow que no se compara en niveles Mi modelo de ti, tengo diez mil carteles Eres ahí, sí, espero Paso a paso demuestra lo que ella tiene Sin reposo te baila tranquila y reggae Por si acaso le muestro lo que tiene el nene Lo que quiero mami, solo que lo tiene Alright, so as you guys can see we're at the BMW dealership And I don't know if the car is still here But let's go ahead and uh, take a walk Anything, anything What do you guys think about the new uh, 3 Series? I like the front. These actually look better when they're all black. They're not bad. I would I would buy one. A 340i though. Anything interesting? Oh, I wonder how much that one is. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Ew. I'm not a fan. Not at all. Oh, this is pretty cool. I had never seen that before. Hmm, not bad. Kind of neat. Kind of ricey in a way, but kind of cool, I guess. I don't know. What do you guys think? See, the kidneys don't look that bad on the black car. But they're still bad, though. They're huge. I don't like them. I know the big, huge grill is in nowadays, but these things are too much. Not for a BMW. Now this, this is nice. This is nice too. Hey guys, so I'm actually thinking about redoing my interior in a different color. I really want red but red is too common now on the f30s well it's not that common but it's more common than what it was before back in the day you know with the whole white and red so i'm thinking about doing something in that color i gotta make some phone calls and see what i can come up with but i only really want to do the seats i don't really want to do the uh, door panels um so it'd, it'd be the seats and the armrest i think it'll look good I just want to go with the color that if I ever decide to wrap the car, I'll actually have more options to match with. It's a nice color. How much is this? Oh, 62. Might as well buy an M3. You guys, this blue is so nice. I wouldn't mind having the F30 in this blue. Damn, look at those calipers. Things are even bigger than the F30s. You guys, look at this combo. Blue with that color interior. Hmm, so good. Damn, that thing is nice. I think I really want to do my seats in that color. Mm-hmm. 
We'll see, we'll see. Maybe not this year, maybe next year. But it's coming. It'll it'll come eventually. We gotta spice up the interior. This is what I'm talking about. This is actually a perfect example. Brown with the white. Yeah, that looks so good. What do you guys think? I like it. And it'll be different than the common white on red. Or red on white. Whichever, however you want to say it. And plus also there's no F30 that comes with that color interior. Especially on white. Actually not at all. I don't think so. I like it. I like it a lot. Hey guys, I think the wagon is gone. I just saw it over there in the front a few days ago. I think that was what, Wednesday when I saw it? It was over there, somewhere, somewhere along that line. <clears throat> uh, uh, yep, I don't see it anymore. All right, so I guess that was a big fail. I guess it sold quick. You don't really see that many wagons and I wanted to see one up close in person. But it's all good. It's all good. All right, well now let me go see if I can find a spot where I can actually show you guys the difference between the burples. I have an old video clip. Um, it was actually done at night. So I'm gonna try to go find a spot where I can do it, where I can rev the car a bit and not actually get in trouble. Um, also, it'll be the difference between medium and soft so yeah guys i'll uh, see you guys whenever i get there all right guys so the burbles that you guys are about to hear are set at 2600 rpms in the soft setting the clip that you're gonna hear after this is set at 2100 rpms with uh, medium setting so I actually I like these a lot better because it's not as loud but I'm actually thinking about going back to the stock uh, burble so I'm not sh sure exactly how that's gonna sound uh, I know the stock one before I did the tune was it was decent uh, but at the same time I like the way that this is and I know it's I don't use it in sport mode all the time now because of the, the pops but I like to have fun with it every now and then but anyways go ahead and uh, let me go ahead and place you guys over here Alright guys, so my battery is about to die. That's going to do it for today's video. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. If you, And then also check out my other video if you want to be entered in the uh, giveaway. Alright guys, see you in the next one.